people you're welcome back again to my channel so in this video we are going to talk about major turn off for guys like things that turns guys off in a relationship but before we dive into the topic please if you are new to this channel don't forget to hit the red subscribe button below to subscribe and of course the notification bell so that you'll be notified each time i upload a new video and if i'm a returning subscriber thank you very much thank you for always coming back so as I said, we are going to talk about five major turn off for guys. So without wasting much of our time, let's dive straight to the point. So major turn off for guys. Are you in a relationship that your guy has started behaving straight like differently from how he was behaving when you guys just met? Is he giving, giving you some kind of attitude that you don't understand? Maybe you have to check yourself because there are some things that you will do that will leave a question mark, like a big question mark in the heart of any guy. There are some things that guy, that most guys don't like. And if you exhibit such character, they will start giving you attitude. Like attitude because there are some things that really turn them off. So here are some major turn off for guys. Uh, um, turn off number one drama drama actually brings stress and no guy would like to be in a relationship where he is stressed instead of him to be in a relationship with you that is receiving stress he better stays alone to have a cold head like if you are that kind of lady that something will happen you will be dramatizing things like instead of you to bring solution you will be asking why did you why did you why did you it it it, it, it doesn't give him the, the 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 avenue to think it doesn't even give him the time to think that it will be stressing his brain and if you are that kind of girl that brings stress instead of solution like that kind of girl that cannot reduce a mountain to a molehill like you instead you instead build a mountain out of a molehill is actually a turn off to guys because they will not like to be in a relationship where you are giving them headache most guys don't like stress so if you are in a relationship, be a positive energy. Don't be that kind of girl that will bring stress to your mind because it's actually a turn off. Point number two, entitlement mentality. Like if you are that kind of girl that thinks, oh, is, if you want to go out for a date, he has to take me out for a date, he has to take me out for a date. And you, even if he takes you out for a date, even thank you, a word of appreciation, you will not appreciate appreciate him you will say it is his job to take me out it is his job no it is not his job to take you out yeah it's actually normal for a, for the guy as the head to be the one to take you out frequently but there are some times that you reciprocate that 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 love that you will show appreciation maybe at least once in a while take him out if you take him out and pay the bills he will not die there are some times that he will even take you out and you contribute to the bills. You, you should not that, have that kind of mindset that he is the one to fold the bills because he is the man. No, even you, you are the, as a woman, you are supposed to, to, to surprise him like once in a while, take him out, pay the bills, once in a while, contribute to the bills. If you are that kind of guy that, girl that always wants him to take you out, always wants him to take you out and pay for the bills, it's actually a turn off to any guy. Another point, if you lack respect, if you're that kind of girl that you don't have respect, like a girl want to say this, you have said your own things, like even if you go, it's not like, it's not only respecting him, you will go out in a garden and they will be talking about something that does not even concern you. Maybe it, it, he takes you in the midst of his friends, they are saying something that does not even concern you, boom, you have put your mouth and you are talking this, maybe you are even shouting, you are even talking more than a man. Guys, that is a turn off for guys because if you are that kind of girl that you talk anyhow, you don't have respect for him or yourself, you talk anyhow, if you, if you are in a garden that they have not called for your attention, that they have not called for your opinion, you don't have to be that forward to just say anything because they are, you, are, you, are, you are with them, you just think you have the right to say anything. No, guys love girls that like they have the love ladies that respect themselves, that respect them and especially in public give them that 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 benefit of doubt like give them that that opportunity to take you out more because if you are that kind of girl that they will take you out and go and embarrass yourself that kind of girl that talk even when they have not asked your opinion 
it's actually an embarrassment to him because he will not want you to, to disrespect him and his friend and talk more than them. No, and most especially you want to drink everything. Like he will take you out for a drink and you'll be drinking more than the men. You will drink, maybe you drink to a point that you start misbehaving. No, it's a turn off for guys. Don't be that kind of fa that kind of forward girl girlfriend that talks anyhow and drinks anyhow in public. No, if you actually that kind of guy is a big turn off for men. Another point, girls without vision. If you're that kind of guy that a guy will ask you, okay, what is your dream in future? What is your vision for tomorrow? Maybe today you will say, um, is this particular field I want to to maybe I'm going I want to be a teacher. Tomorrow they'll ask you say lawyer. The next day they'll ask you no, you don't have focus. It's a turn off for guy for for guys because they will actually see you as somebody that does not have vision. And nobody will want to spend a lifetime with someone that does not have vision. So be that kind of girl that is purpose driven. At least you should have a purpose of existence. You will, you should have a purpose, you have a, a what you want to do. It don't be that kind of irresponse uh, like that kind of visionless a girl that you don't even know what you want in your life the girl, the girl will say go to this place today you will go tomorrow they say okay don't go to the place again instead of you to insist that no this is where i want to go you will just sit the girl will tell you to go this way you go do this way you go you don't have vision you don't have plan for your own life if you are that kind of girl that you are easily pushed around maybe the guy will be Telling you to do this, do this, to see how you act if you are that kind of somebody that has vision that you know what you want and you will stand on it. But if they are pushing you, go this way, go this way, and you are still going, it's actually a major turn off for guys. And the last point, irresponsible girl, uh, girls. Irresponsibility is a turn off to guys because there are some girls that don't want to do anything for themselves. Like they see guys guys as the means to ex escape poverty you are there maybe you have gone to school and you don't want to look for a job they will give you a job you say no you don't want you don't want to start here you want you, you don't want a job that you don't want to do something that you will start from somewhere you just want an automatic money like you see getting married to a guy as an as a route to escape poverty no those kind of those, those kind of ladies are a major turn off to to guys why because a guy will see okay if i get married to this one what does he have to con have to contribute maybe in the future if i am in a financial crisis can he can she handle can she take care of the home can she handle my finances even because irresponsible girls will not even know they will know that all what is in their head is to spend to spend go for expensive things go for luxurious things meanwhile they don't have anything to bring on the table by the end of the month if you are that kind of girl it is a very big turn off because that guy will see that oh this one is just to waste my money it's just to, to just waste my time this one does not have any vision he's not responsible he cannot do anything he cannot even take care of the kids all he has in his in her mind is to spend so those kind of girls they are a major turn off for guys so if you are that kind of gay, you have to change. If your guy is behaving a type, just check yourself. Think what you are not doing right. Because the guy cannot just automatically change like that. Maybe there are some people that came with an, a, with an ulterior motive. But if you are that guy that really loved you at the beginning, then all of a sudden you start behaving a type. Check yourself. Be responsible. Don't be a drama queen. Be that kind of girl that has vision that can support a guy's dream. Yeah, be that kind of person that can support a guy's gym because if you cannot support a guy's gym, it's a turn off for them and they will not want to spend lifetime. A responsible guy will not like to spend lifetime with somebody that does not have gym. So that is all about this video. Please, if you like the video, give it a thumb up, thumbs up. If you don't like the video, please drop your opinion down below why you don't like the video. I'll be at the comment section following. Please, if you have not subscribed, don't forget to hit the red subscribe button now. Please, and turn on the new on the notification bell so that whenever i upload a new video you will be the first to be notified thank you for following this far i will see you in my next video or you will see me in my next video as for now bye